What's going on guys, it's your friend Jack, and if you read the title, which you might have done, you're gonna know that I shaved my freaking head. Yep, buzzed it all off, we're going for it, and I'm gonna tell you why, and I wanna kinda make a little metaphor, make a little few assumptions about how I think this head right here is gonna make me more money online. So it's been about a week since I did one of these videos, at least these me and you just talking videos. And this one I made ultra ultra clickbait and I'm sorry for that, but you gotta play the YouTube game sometimes and I wanted to, you know, you guys to hear me out on why I think, you know, a little bit of change, a buzz cut, something like that that's a little bit drastic is a good thing in your life and can also propel you in your goals in general. So the idea that I want to talk about today is making decisions. Because basically, I decided that I was going to buzz cut my hair last night while I was in bed. I don't really know why. I kind of just thought of it and decided, you know what, I'm going to do it. And when you have a, something in your mind and you want to make it and you make a decision, it almost always ends up you fall through that with that decision because making a decision means you plan on following through, right? So the reason I think something like this, a decision of buzzing my head can be related to pretty much anything in life is because once you make a decision, a decision <laughs> that you're going to do something and you actually do it, you build kind of this self-confidence with yourself and you realize that when you say you're going to do something or if you decide you're going to do something, you can do it. And why is this so important and related to making money online, you might ask? Well, making money online requires a lot of persistence. So if you can make the initial decision, even if you haven't started yet, to, you know, decide, okay, my goal is to make money online. I don't exactly know how, and I don't really, I have no idea how I'm going to do this, but you make a decision that you were going to make, you know, $1,000 a month online. It doesn't matter how, but you are not going to give up on trying until you get there. A little bit of a short-winded example of being a buzz cut. You make the decision and the action you take and the solution, you already know how to kind of solve the problem. But say I didn't know how to solve the problem, I have to initially make the decision for me to even get close to knowing how to solve the problem or thinking about it and actually following through with doing it. So decisions are really just writing out your goals that's something that's really important i think if you don't write out your goals and you kind of just you know end up where you end up you're not going to end up where you really want to end up uh, or you would rather end up somewhere better than if you actually wrote your goals down compared to if you didn't write your goals down so was this video or is this video a complete clickbait video yes it was and i made the decision that i was going to do that just to see what would happen what you guys think, and I'm kind of sorry, but at the same time, YouTube is a very cool game, and it's kind of fun to see, you know, the click-through rates, you know, test out different things, and just test what works, test what people actually want to see, test if you guys are even still watching at this point. So the reason I think buzz cutting my hair can relate to making money online or doing something that you actually want to accomplish in your life is because there's four steps, really. You got to make a decision and then you have to make a plan how am i going to do that then you kind of have to put the plan into action and persevere through all that stuff and then the fourth step is your end result which is a buzz cutted head or the end of your goal so that's why i think that you know doing whatever you want to do or need to do in life you need to set goals and you need to make decisions to actually start writing down your goals that's a decision right there if you've decided to write down your goals you're one step closer to getting to the end result, the step four. So I think it's really important and I want to share that with you guys. I haven't talked to the camera in a while and I kind of miss it, just spitballing my ideas out there. I have a lot of ideas up in here, as I'm sure you do as well, but if you have any ideas and you want to share them on your mindset, on your thoughts, on my thoughts, leave them down in the comments below. I'll be sure to look at them, respond to them, heart them, all that good stuff, so definitely do that. And that's pretty much the whole video. Just a little update, me and you talking back and forth. And if you're wondering, this is like some weird egg yolk stuck on my head uh, since I was born. So that's what that is. And with that being said, it's been your friend Jack. I hope you guys have a great freaking day. Keep striving. Keep working towards your goals. If you don't have goals, set some goals and get working towards them. And I'll see you guys in the next freaking video.